Overdose deaths among teenagers have been on the rise for years, and now the Biden administration says it wants all schools to carry naloxone, the medication that reverses an opioid overdose. But can a simple nasal spray actually save lives? I reached out to local schools and the Spokane Fire Department to learn more about naloxone and if they're carrying it to keep our kids safe. In the past two decades, more than 5,000 children and teens in the U.S. have died from overdoses involving fentanyl, according to JAMA Pediatrics. But thankfully, naloxone, also known as Narcan, is readily available to help reverse the effects of an overdose. You can administer the naloxone and they almost instantly take a deep breath, often wake up right away. Ann Not Raven has plenty of experience Spokane. using Narcan with the Spokane Fire so, Department, and she believes it's a great idea to have it in schools because seconds matter when someone is overdosing on an opioid like fentanyl. We're always going to be there in four to six, four to eight minutes, but that is too much if you're not breathing, so it's ideal to have it there on scene. Rebecca Dowdy of Spokane Public Schools agrees. We make sure that all of our staff um, that will have access to that medication, that they're, they're trained to use it. She says SPS high schools already had Narcan, but last winter they started carrying it in all schools and school buildings. The Coeur d'Alene School District has it in all schools and school buildings as well, and Central Valley schools have it in high schools and middle schools. And our kids don't just exist in the school building. So um, they have homes, uh, they are out in the neighborhood, so we never know what they're going to get their hands on um, and have access to and may have a health emergency while they're at school. If you're using this, chances SPS are schools keep Narcan it. right next to their because AEDs. Not, Jennifer Smelser, the registered opioid nurse opioid at Shadle Park High School, takes it one step further, <laughs> keeping Narcan in a bag she keeps on her at all times. For that reason, I don't want to be on the third floor in a bathroom and not have it available to me. So I carry it with me so I don't have to run and get it. And Smelser has had to administer Narcan when a student was having difficulty breathing and appeared to be having a seizure. What this kid was experiencing wasn't an opioid overdose, so it didn't do anything. But then 911 came and took care of the situation. But just how likely is an opioid overdose? According to Spokane County, fentanyl deaths for all ages increased more than fivefold between 2020 and 2022, from 28 to 147. Deaths from methamphetamine more than doubled during that same time frame, from 56 to 120. But in 2022, there were only four accidental drug deaths for children between the ages of 10 and 19 in the county. So even though it's not very likely at all, SPS doesn't want to take any chances. It's not that students are necessarily going out and looking for fentanyl. Um, sometimes other things that they take can be laced with that. Um, we just don't know what our kids are going to be encountering. It's not going to hurt someone if you give it to them and they don't need it. But if they do need it and you don't have it, then they're probably going to die. That's scary. And even though there is some cost to carrying Narcan in schools, Ann Raven believes it's absolutely worth it. It's a, it's a form of rescue treatment, just like CPR, just like an AED. If you have an AED, available, you should have Narcan available too. It's a life-saving medication our schools can carry to protect our most precious lives. And Derek, you had special access inside of the school talking with the people who carry this and as we heard in a, in a purse, you know, it's that yeah. small. The cost, I think, is what a lot of people worry about. Right. And they're they're all proponents of, of carrying it. And there is some cost. A two pack of Narcan is about 40 to 45 dollars. So if you're a school district with, let's say, 10, 20 schools, it can cost you a few hundred dollars, right, to stock it in all your buildings. But every single one of them says, absolutely worth it, yeah. no brainer. And they even say in today's day and age, if somebody's unconscious and you don't know why, give them Narcan because it literally can't hurt and it could save a life. It's just as small as just like a, an allergy medication right? or exactly. something. Incredible. Well, very good to hear.